Hi guys, it's your girl Kara coming to you with a review. Sorry, I've been gone for so long. Um, I've been going through some tough personal times, but anyway, um, <laughs> came to your review uh, with for a review with the hair that I have in now, um, which is Model Model Icon. Um, it was very very inexpensive. I actually have two packs in my hair. Um, this I have a 12 and a 14. And the hair comes about bra strap length on me. Oh, actually, it was maybe a little bit lower. And I am 5'7 and a half, though I claim 5'8. Um, <laughs> but anyway, um, I actually really, really like this hair. I would recommend it for anybody. I will be buying it again. Um, I apologize. I did throw away the package. Um, but the hair uh, for two packs, I paid $45 at my local beauty supply store. So very, very inexpensive hair. If you're on a budget or you just want like some two, three week hair, this is going to be it. This is not going to be the kind of two, three week hair that you're fighting with the entire two weeks. No, this is actually like decent hair. Um, I'm going to start with the pros and then I'll go to the cons. The pros, uh, very, very little shedding in the hair. I did not cut the tracks until I got up here. Um, other than that I use the fold over method which if you're unfamiliar it's when you take one track and you go back and forth all the way around your head um, until you get to the end of the actual uh, weft I guess. Um, anyway so that's what I did and um, yeah so not a lot of shedding. I mean even now let's see uh, nothing I didn't get anything. So um, the hair doesn't shed very much. Um, it is very, very easy to wash. That's usually my biggest issue with hair. That's actually usually right after I take it out. Um, I, it will be after I've washed it when it'll get all crazy looking. But this hair washed really well. Um, I did not use shampoo. I did use the co-wash method on the hair. So this hair has not been shampooed at all. I just shampooed my little leave out and um, co-wash this hair. What I have been using um, to co-wash the hair, which today was my second time washing it, um, for my um, shampoo, quote unquote, which is obviously so conditioner, I've been using this Garnier Fructis Triple Nutrition. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's triple Nutrition for dry damaged hair. I got this a year or two ago at like Walmart or Target for like three or four bucks. Um, this is actually technically what you would consider a protein conditioner. So it actually took really well to the hair. I actually don't like how it feels on my personal hair. Um, but uh, it actually works really well with, with this hair. Then I came back and as the leave-in, or I guess not necessarily the leave-in, the conditioner that I did, uh, I left on for like an hour, the deep conditioner, I used this Suave Keratin Infusion. You can see that. Um, it is Suave Professionals Keratin Infusion Salon, Salon Proven Smoothing Conditioner for Frizzy and Unmanageable Hair. Um, there are two types of this, so you want to be careful. Um, I know that some ladies on here are using the one for color treated hair. They say that it works wonderful. I can't really attest to that one. I can say that this regular one works really good. And I actually got this at Walgreens for $3. So neither of these products are very expensive. And that's it. I don't put anything else on the hair. Um, I wouldn't recommend putting any kind of oils on the hair because uh, yesterday or the day before I put almond oil, which is in general a light oil. I put maybe a quarter size amount in my palm, put it on my leave out and then rub the rest on the weave and then that's when I felt like it started to get a little tangly so I don't recommend putting any products on this hair whatsoever um, that's just my recommendation to keep it looking nice and to keep it silky I mean as you can see it's very very flowy and just really manageable um, so those are my pros for the for the hair cons the wefts are very very thin uh, I apologize, I've actually uh, used all the hair, or I, I think I put up the rest, but I can't find it. But anyway, the wefts are just really, really thin. So what that means is, is that you actually, if you like a really thick, full head, you really might need to get three packs of hair. This is two that I have in, um, if you want to get a good look at it. So this is two. Um... I like it like this, but I can say that just like any other hair, I feel like it's actually gotten 
a little thicker feel to it since I washed it because it did feel a bit thinner before. Um, that is definitely a con um, for a lot of people um, because you are going to have to sew a lot in order to get a thick full um, head. Um, the second con is going to be that this hair does not hold a curl very well at all. Um, I would say that it's gotten better since I have washed it, but it literally, it will curl for you, but the curls will fall really quickly. Just as an example, if I curl my hair in the morning, by the time I get to work, my hair, the curls are starting to fall. Midway, probably around 10, 10 I have wavy hair, and then by lunchtime, I have straight hair. So it does not, it does not curl very good at all. Um, and I have curled it with my flat iron, and I've also tried to curl it with flexi rods. Flexi rods do tend to work the best. I do not, however, put anything on my hair with the flexi rods because this is basic beauty supply store hair. So I know some people with like their virgin hair, they take and they mix like water and um, um, wrap lotion. No. I would not do this with this hair because this it seems like if you put something on this hair that's when it starts to get kind of tangly and and stuff in the back and I mean as you can see the back of my hair is not tangly at all um, so those are gonna be my cons I do normally like to wear my hair big and curly with like 70s fair faucet wings and all kinds of curls in it not really happening with this hair um, but on the flip side, with the thin tracks, it does really help it to lay flat against your head. So if you're like me, I love to wear headbands and things like that. And I usually find that depending on how I do my install, which I'm not very good, I'm definitely not a professional, um, but depending on how I do it, sometimes it just looks ridiculous because the hair is already kind of big. But um, with this, I can put a headband on and it actually tends to look a lot more natural because it's not quite as full as like most people would do their weaves so it just really depends on what you like um, that is really all that I have for you guys again these are the two products that I used probably run you six fifty seven bucks for the both which is excellent hair um, again two packs it's model model icon uh, I have a 12 inch and a 14 inch and uh, that's basically it so thanks for watching